you guys my echo tachometer that I've used in so many of my videos finally took a crap the other day and I uh, put a new battery in it the, the, the display is just not working anymore and uh, we're going to be reviewing the easy tack plus from uh, electronic specialties the model number on its 328 we'll get it unboxed here in just a moment and uh, we'll go outside and we're in the shop and we're going to hook this up to several pieces of equipment and uh, it does two and four cycles all the way up to an eight cylinder engine which the echo tack would not do so this may be an upgrade for the toolbox and i'll put all of the uh, information you need about this new tachometer in the description below so uh stay tuned and we'll get this thing unboxed and we'll see how she turns out a little blister pack it's real super easy to get open And basically all you get is the tachometer and your antenna lead. You can use the tachometer with or without the lead. Now it's just a regular like a old style RCA style plug I guess you'd call it and you just plug it in here in the antenna port and you can run this lead down to a spark plug wire that you possibly couldn't get to turn this on we're going to hit reset and if you look here in the upper left corner it's on two cycle one cylinder well I'm going to hit the select button or the selection button for your cycles and your strokes str means stroke two stroke two cylinder two stroke four cylinder and then it goes to four cycle. One cylinder, two cylinder, three, four, five, six, seven, and so forth. Then it goes back to two cycle. And over here, we have a backlight, which is really cool. You hit it once, and then you hit it twice, and then you have a flashlight to help see what in the heck you're doing and down in an engine bay or something. Also use it with the lead that is supplied with the machine, uh, the tachometer. Whoopsie.
motorcycle, single cylinder, and then we can do it wireless. Just, all you got to do is hold it down by the spark plug. Works great for automotive use as well. In this particular case, you would really want to use the lead to go to your spark plug wire. So you don't get your hand chopped off. And it's within spec. Idle speed on these newer cars are not adjustable. Probably has some interference from the, the other spark plug wires. What you should do is uh, go to the number one spark plug lead by itself. I've always wanted to test the RPMs on the old test mule. So get the hood raised up on here and uh, see if we can't get her as close to 3400 as possible. Idling a little bit fast. I think the spec is 1750 on this engine. Let's see if we can't get my old Echo here to spin some Mars. I've had this old I've had this old Echo since about 2002. I've had to put a carburetor on it, but that's it. that carburetor and I can easily get 10,000 RPMs out of this trimmer but I, I don't want to burn it up. I like to run my two cycles just on the verge of you know how they'll go I like to get it right in that sweet spot buddy so when you get a load on it she runs like a Cadillac watch I've also had a ton of people ask me about this I start well they put them on uh, some echo equipment back in the day and I don't think they make this particular one anymore but what it is it's got a heavy heavy spring that goes around the starter recoil pulley and then whenever you load that big heavy spring up it then spins the engine over
I don't cut commercial. I cut my own yard. And yes, I take the guard off. I don't need comments saying, oh, you're going to break somebody's window out. The only, the only window I'm going to break out is my own. Hey guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, man, in today's small engine shop, you've just about got to have a tachometer. Uh, they don't give carburetor settings hardly anymore. You adjust the carburetor to get a proper RPM setting, especially in the Mtronic steels and the newer Echoes. Uh, it's just, if, if you don't set these carburetors right and they start hitting on that rev limiter and you're lean and you don't know it, you're going to smoke a motor in just a minute. But uh, thumbs up. Click the bell and get all my new videos. Uh, more Medic One. Y'all have a good holiday. And uh, we'll see you on the next video. For show. Sure.